what really pushed me toward engineering was kind of the excitement I had around the idea of building things and innovation. So right now I'm studying electrical engineering with a specialization in biomedical engineering. So I think what really led me to be interested in that was first an interest in computer hardware, sustainability and renewable energy. And on the biomedical engineering side, I thought assistive devices and medical devices were really fascinating. For the past few years during the school year, I've been working part time as a teaching assistant for one of the first year engineering courses at UEC. And I've also been working part time as a research assistant in a lab mostly related to electrical and biomedical engineering research. And in the summers, I worked some engineering internships. So last summer, I was working at Microsoft, and this summer, I'm working at Goldman Sachs. For a while, I had been interested in um, sustainability, the environment, and I think it really aligned with kind of my values and interests to pursue something related to that. And in my first year, I also um, had the opportunity to work on a project um, in the curriculum where we designed an assisted device for um, someone with a disability. And that was a really meaningful experience for me. And I think I was really passionate about building assistive devices and being able to work directly with people to solve problems. So that kind of led to the biomedical engineering interest as well. At my university, some clubs I've been involved with are the Undergraduate um, Engineering Society, the Electrical and Computer Engineering Student Society, Women in Engineering. And I think what really brought me to be involved in women in engineering was one being able to find a really supportive and inclusive community within engineering in a field that can be sometimes quite male dominant and also I guess being able to contribute to those communities that have really supported me and um, build those connections to provide opportunities for other people to succeed has been um, really rewarding. So another group I've been involved with is with the Electrical and Computer Engineering Student Society at UBC. So with that group, um, this past year I was the Vice President Academic of the Society and this coming year I'm in the same role. And it's been a really great opportunity to um, work on inclusion and diversity and equity initiatives, um, advocate for student needs um, and curriculum changes and it's been a really great opportunity to meet new people, um, build useful skills and um, just kind of explore what I'm interested in and different skills that um, I want to develop. I really value leading by example and I guess creating opportunities for other people to um, show up in ways genuine to them and be able to contribute to the community in the ways that they're also passionate about. So I think leadership to me has really been an opportunity to pursue what I'm passionate about and have that freedom as well as create opportunities for other people to have that as well. So right now I'm still really figuring things out and exploring different options. Um, though after I graduate, I would love to pursue a career in electrical or biomedical engineering. I think um, having a career in sector like medical devices or in firmware or hardware would be really interesting. I think there's a lot of interesting technical challenges um, in those fields that would be really interesting to work on. Mm -hmm.